Oh, you son of a... Why is it all fog lights? That's what I want to know. What is this circle? Is it stuff that was burning? The fact that all of these fires are still burning makes it seem like there were people here recently. Why is this structure here? What purpose does this serve? Oh, hello. Oh, hey! Behold, for nigh is the time of the sword and axe, the age of the woven blizzard. Nigh is the time of the white frost and white light, the time of madness and disdain. Ted Diradi, the final age. The world shall perish amidst ice and be reborn with the new sun, reborn of the elder blood of Hen Iker of a planted seed, a seed that will not sprout, but burst into flames. Es tuath ese? I don't know. So shall it be. Watch for the signs, and I say unto you what signs they shall be. First, the earth will run with the blood of the Ein Shi, the blood of the elves. That is Ithlin's prophecy. That's like, that's been the, the thing that people have been referencing to since the first game. And whenever people say nigh is the time of the sword and axe, that's what they're talking about. So Ithlene was basically just, I don't remember what time, what age she was in. Like, I am at, I'm pretty sure she's dead now. That she was like, she lived a long time ago in the time of this game. But she was basically just an elven prophetess. Who would have these just divine visions and prophecies and such and that was her most famous one that tells about it foretells the uh, the end of the world pretty much by the white frost where there'll basically be an ice age that will destroy all life where is this going I don't want to be going farther away from the tree, but I find myself curious. Oh, is that just... Hmm. Oh, hello. Wait, have I... 
Did I go in here before? Yes, I did. There were drowners in here. When I couldn't, uh, when I couldn't go up there, I came down here instead. I remember that. And where does this go? Oh, hello. It's very Pirates of the Caribbean. Huh. Whoa. What is this? What is this? Wozers, dude. What are we walking into? And why does it look like it's broad daylight outside when it's just past midnight? Oh, hmm. Nifty. I guess it's a really full moon again. Looks like a rock to me. <laughs> Is this just gonna like circle back around to the beginning? And that's kind of what it looks like. Yeah, I just went in a big circle. Back up we go. That's a shame, because it looked like it was going somewhere super epic. <laughs> Alright, now onward and upwards. There's the tree. What's that fire? This is what I'm going for, this question mark here. Hmm. Okay, there's no way that... There's no way I'm still this far away from that tree. It looks like it's right in front of me. What is this? Holy crap, dude, this is blowing my mind. <gasps> no. Oh, no. Oh, I am so sad. Oh, I am so upset. Oh. <laughs> Oh, that makes me so sad. Son of a bitch, dude. I was getting so into it. I was so excited to see what was going to happen. <sighs> After having to wait so long to be strong enough to fight my way up here. Damn, dude. That is frustrating. Hmm, 
We just next stop here. Where's here again? This one has suffered greatly on account of war. Its inhabitants have abandoned their property and evacuated lands in which they once dwelled in relative peace. Hmm. Ugh. I am so very upset by that. So is that tree not the same one then? Is that not the same one that the mother of the woods or whatever was trapped inside? And you know, since since I bring that up, I find myself wondering, and I don't think I've asked this question before, if the if the ladies of the wood really wanted that their mother, that spirit, whoever she was, dead, then why, obviously she was weak, obviously she was easily killed since I was able to do it with, you know, just a sword, so why couldn't they have just killed her? Because obviously they have large amounts of power. Seems like it shouldn't have been too difficult for him to do. Or oh, well, I guess maybe it's not so much that they wanted her dead, as it is that the people of that town of Lindenvale wanted it dead. Because it was causing trouble for him. And they asked the ladies of the wood for assistance. And so they sent Geralt. Which I really have to pee, but I don't want to end this recording early. Because it's a pain to snip, to splice them together. Grr. I don't know how long it still has left. Can't be too much longer now. I can hold it. <laughs> uh, where is this map taking me? I'm just gonna take the boat, I think. Dude, that just... That little him sliding into the tree like that just made me think of... When I used to go walking around in the woods all the time. Sometimes when I had to go down a slope. Like what you would do to go down... Uh, steep slopes, you just let yourself slide down and grab onto trees on your way down for support to stop yourself from falling and steer yourself. And it's so fun to do that. Whoa. Wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Alright, where are we going? Oh. Oh. Not that far, I guess. You know what? I think I'm just gonna take this boat around. Around to here. That'll save us some time, I think. Sure, it's more roundabout, not directly through, but I won't have to deal with the terrain. So, let's do that. There we go. And actually... There we go, yeah. Let's just rest and refill all of my bombs and oils. Why does it use 